I just wanted to show you how in the Wide Format Inkjet plugin we have a new Material Waste Calculations tab that lets you control the material waste calculations quite finely. If you're familiar with our Flatbed Inkjet printing plugin, then you already know about this tab. If you've only been using Wide Format Inkjet and haven't seen our Flatbed plugin, well then you're in for a treat because this is coming in Estimate 2011 and will be added to your plugin. So let's enter the print specs, like for example, 120 by 30 inch prints. The rest doesn't matter for what I'm going to show you. Jump over in here to material waste calculations, and it will actually show you the best fit and nesting that needs to be done in order to print these prints, as well as the waste factor that's left over when it's all said and done. And then it lets you come down here and charge different ways for the waste media and laminate. So you can choose to charge the same markup as for printed material. So, for example, if you've got your uh, print media marked up 100%, then it will also charge 100% for a markup for the scrap area. Um, you can charge a different markup. Let's say you want to charge just you know 20% on that. You can do that right here. And then also, you can choose not to charge for scrap. And that's what the Material Waste Calculations tab will do for you and gives you fine-tuned control over how you handle your scrap when pricing jobs. Thanks for watching.